All right, go ahead. So we'll look in the IP 172.21.140.105, right? Uh, blah, 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 blah. That sounds right. <laughs> uh, let me try to uh, open up the uh, printer page. Just to make sure. Okay. Yep, that's it. Okay. Yep, thank you. Oh, this is to Chrome, so we, we Yeah, no, we have to go to, yeah, we have to go to, yep. I would have to use this and all that, okay.
Yeah, it's, that's the same error I got before. There we go. There you go. Awesome. Uh, do you want to test scan to make sure? Um, Everything should be good now. Yeah, I think, I think uh, we're good. These, yeah, because what we've done, aside from uh, adding the IP of the printer into the uh, exception in Java, we uh, added this uh, script. It's in a notepad. Uh, here it is. So just add that to the, yeah. Yes, and uh, the reason why we add this is then that you're using Java version 131, there are instances that this page would still know, but um, it would not have any labels here. You'll just yeah. see boxes and that's being passed by the version itself. It's either we add this script or we downgrade it to Java 121. And of course, we don't want to downgrade it. So okay. here's the script. You just have to uh, copy the Java policy yep. in the C drive, put it in the desktop, add the IP of the printer, yep. and then save it, put it back into the uh, Java folder in your C drive. Okay. Do you have any other questions or concerns aside from this? No, that will do it. You've been very helpful. Thank you. You're welcome, Ivan. I'll uh, continue to the remote access. There might be a quick uh, automated survey after the call. It's just a short survey, uh, three question survey. So I'm hoping that you can stay in the line to participate. So uh, 